Good morning, DCS. Welcome to Online Learning. Today is Tuesday, May the 12th, 2020. Our word of the month today for the month of May is determination, deciding it's worth it to finish what you've started. So let's finish strong. Hey, we have a birthday. Happy birthday to Edwin Regist. We hope you have a wonderful day. Today, you're gonna to log into Canvas by 10 a.m. and either view the pre-recorded classes for or participate in live class for periods two and four. And remember, if you are logging in with an iPad or an iPhone, make sure that you let Ms. Dean know so she can capture your attendance. And we've put together a schedule for students in grades six through 11 um, to come to the school during the week of May 18th to the 20th, that's next week. And that will be so that you can retrieve items from your lockers. We have a team who's cleaned out the lockers and they have bagged the contents and put your name on it. So you and your parents can drive up to the school loop and we will hand you your things during the next, uh, during those three days during the next week. So please read the email and the message on Canvas with uh, the schedule and when your grade level is assigned to come to the school. However, if that time that you are scheduled uh, does not work for you, please feel free to come when you can during those three days during those scheduled times. And even if you think you have nothing to retrieve, this is also a time to bring back library books and uh, textbooks that you might not be utilizing right now. And seniors, if you have books to drop off during this time, this will work for you. Laptops, there was a question about turning in laptops. Well, I want you to keep your laptops until the, after the last day of school. We will schedule a time um, during that next week in June um, that you can turn in laptops and then any textbooks that you are using until the end of the year. So no worries there. Hang on to your laptops and, um, and keep working. We want you to do that. Senior, your May newsletter has all your information that you need uh, for the, um, all of the events, uh, graduation, college acceptance day, and um, uh, honors and awards. So please make sure that uh, you are uh, up to date on that. And if you need any assistance on that, please send an email. But we want to celebrate you. And we want to thank everyone for their patience as we are putting these virtual events together. And we're looking forward to doing that. We also want to wish uh, the best of luck to all the students who are participating in the AP exams. Um, you know, this, this is being done very differently this year, and but we know that when you prepare for these uh, tests, it, it's very challenging, and we appreciate that you are determined and committed to finishing strong. So success will only be attained if you prepare strongly, uh, if you do your best, if you are determined and persevere through all of the, these assessments, uh, you will do great. Um, so we want to wish you the best as you, um, both for students and teachers, um, to commit, being committed to finishing the school year strong. So thank you for all of your work toward the AP exams. We want to wish everyone good luck today and every day. And we are hoping for a better day today and across the world. <clears throat> so now for some words of wisdom. Today is the oldest you have ever been. It's also the youngest you will ever be again. So we want you to live life fully, have no regrets. Let's do our best to have our best life today and let's work to finish strong. We miss you, we will be together soon. We are Hawk Strong. With something to think about, this is Dr. Andrews. Make it a great day. The choice is yours. Have a wonderful day, everyone.